All right, so let's talk what I call spin class um, or moment of inertia. So moment of inertia is a little bit more exciting than inertia in the linear world because you, we can manipulate it. And so many of our human movements and our, our sporting activities, um, are we manipulate moment of inertia to make them pretty spectacular. So just to review, when you're moving an object, you need to apply a force to that object to accelerate it, all right? And so if you remember, F equals MA becomes impulse um, equals momentum. And that, that inertia that's resisting our force, um, or technically the tendency of a body to resist acceleration, um, is in the linear world, our mass. So that is our inertia. So we want to move really fast, but we have this inertia or our mass in the way. And its units are kilogram, it's a quantity of matter. Size doesn't completely dictate inertia. Um, and we talked about a volleyball and a bowling ball, very similar sizes, but very different masses and thus very different inertias. All right, so then we get into this um, rotational world. And so instead of a force um, moving an object to accelerate it, you apply a torque, a force times a moment arm, to an object to accelerate it. So you have torque equals now this moment of inertia to result in this acceleration. 